from the cottage up at Blue Mountain. It's live from last week, episode 107. Let's go! Welcome, my fellow Jaywalkers, to another episode of Live from Last Week. Hope last week has served you well. Just a quick shameless plug before we go on. I want you guys to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel. So here I am starting off my 2023 with the same habits that I had in 2022. Needing to be more healthy and catching up on sleep with sleep patterns like this. Getting only 14 hours of sleep when at minimum I should have at least 18 hours over the past three days. I decided to get on the stationary bike for the first time in a while since this episode of Live from last week. And do number nine in my New Year's goals to see how much progress I'll hopefully be making at the end of 2023. But it will be hard considering all the food that we have to get through in our fridge from over the holidays, including that mammoth turkey leg that I got from a Duave's turkey during New Year's Eve. But moving on, earlier today, the wife and I went to Fairview Mall for the first time this year to visit the Lego store to see what kind of Lego sets that her and I are interested in buying in the future. When we came across this display where if you showed your Lego playset in front of the camera, an interactive video would pop up on the screen showing what kind of cool Lego contents were inside that Lego playset. And well, eventually, after half an hour being inside that store, the wife allowed me to take this pretty cool Lego set home, which I was ecstatic about since it was my first Lego purchase in years. And well, in return, I allowed the wife to test out this $15,000 first class massage chair on our way home. But anyways, before I let you guys go for the night, I have a quick birthday greeting to one of my Y68 friends out there, Matthew! Happy birthday, Matt! Also, a birthday shout out to a friend that I wanted to visit while he was living up in Winnipeg. This birthday greeting goes out to you, Marvin! Happy birthday, Marvin! Next up, a birthday greeting to a friend that I used to have dance classes with back when I was younger. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Carly! Happy birthday, Carly! And last but not least, a birthday shout out to a family friend who I used to hang out with back when Nini Eliza was a little Nini. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Ia. Happy birthday, Ia. I'm hoping that all my friends and family members that have their birthdays today are doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time, and had a great celebration for your birthdays this year. After recalling that I broke my Fitbit watch band yesterday evening, but getting a decent sleep last night, waking up at 6 a.m. to drive the wife to work for her day shift, I decided to do the stereotypical New Year's thing and head to my local Planet Fitness to do a quick 30-minute Planet Fitness Express workout. And remembering that I'm pretty out of shape right now, in order to recover, I utilized my Planet Fitness Black Card membership using their patented Hydro Massage chairs for the first time this year, as well as these coin-operated massage chairs before going back home to rest up for the day and going in for my first of my scheduled three night shifts. But yeah, time to make my way back to the condo and relax, and I'll just catch you guys again tomorrow. So after my night shift this morning, I decided to keep up with my healthy habits by hopping on the stationary bike and not just exercising physically, but exercising mentally as well. Putting on a Duolingo podcast in the background while I get my workout on. Then after taking a decent post night shift nap today, passing by Bathurst at the former location of Honest Ed's, I'm currently at the Ossington and Bloor area to get some free night shift eats at a local restaurant that I haven't been to since they opened up outdoor dining during the pandemic. The one, the only, Lally Bellas. And before we go in for my second of my scheduled three night shifts, 
we have a birthday greeting to a former Wysock resident of mine who I used to look over while I was a CA there. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Daniel. Happy birthday, Daniel. We've also got a birthday shout out to a childhood friend who is quite the talent on the soccer pitch. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Jimmy. Happy birthday, Jimmy. I'm hoping that all my friends that have their birthdays today are doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time, and had a great celebration for your birthdays this year. Did I mention that last night, while walking around pre-night shift, I passed by the restaurant where we saw that one imposter of the wife the last time we were in this area. Eventually, hitting up one of our favorite spots in Koreatown at Pat to do the ritual that I always do while I'm in this area of buying the wife a nice surprise treat for her to have after her day shift in the form of this beautiful custard taiyaki slash bungopang. Anyways, on to this morning, when we said goodbye to a couple of my coworkers who were moving on from my workplace to pursue bigger and better career opportunities. Guys, it's my Eeyore's last day today. <laughs> She's the one, the beautiful artist, <laughs> that made this picture for me several years ago. And it's so good in your locker. Nice working with you, Eeyore. Best of luck for the future. <laughs> I was also able to give one of my buddies, who we've seen in previous Lab From Last Week episodes, the very first and last mini carpool as a co-worker. Yo, for the first and last time in the mini carpool, we've got special guest, Robert. Because hey. it's his last day working with us. Last night. Yeah, last night. Sad times. But we did share a moment while watching the World Juniors hockey game where Kanda scored in OT. <laughs> Any last words, man? No, oh, pleasure working with you, though. All right. Good man. That's it. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Robert. Yeah, thank you. Oh, All the good times. Bye. Thank you. But before leaving them this morning and the wife and I going to go through the drive through to get our first taste of McDonald's this year, we were at least able to meet Robert's little doggo, his pride and joy, the one we call Daisy. So this is a Daisy I've been hearing a lot about. Oh, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> but moving on, before I go in for my third scheduled night shift tonight, we have a quick birthday shout out to one of my volleyball buddies with whom I played indoor with since back in the Cabbage Town Youth Center days. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Jerome. Happy birthday, Jay. I'm hoping that at this time, you and your family are doing well, staying safe and healthy, and that you had a great celebration for your birthday this year. Straight after my night shift and picking up my niece this morning, the wife and I did the two hour drive straight from downtown to go to Boo Mountain to have a weekend cottage getaway with the cousins. Where I was able to open up a package containing my 5x7 Blue Mountain ski pass and get raw reactions of my cousins seeing my new profile picture on this year's pass. <laughs> Last year, <laughs> <laughs> Did you see it? Oh, just go, go around. <laughs> <laughs> Don't judge yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 Reactions have changed. Oh, <laughs> 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 I want to see it. <laughs> Anyways, on the first day of the weekend here at the cottage, this is what we were up to.
after a great time with the cousins last night, which was wrapped up with highlights of this pretty funny game. Wow. Playing hide and seek with some toy guns. Someone's on the couch. We're continuing our time here at Blue Mountain with the second day of our weekend. But before we go on with the highlight video of things that we did today, we have a quick birthday greeting to one of my FCAR friends that I haven't seen in a while. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Melvin. Happy birthday, Melvin. I'm hoping at this time you're doing well, staying safe and healthy, and that you had a great celebration for your birthday this year. But anyways, on to the highlights of today, where we got to use our five by seven passes and go out for the first ski trip of 2023, here's our music video of what we did today on Sunday. After yet another fun time at Blue Mountain yesterday. <laughs> Woo! Phone tag. Phone tag. Going down the hill. Oh, yes. oh! This morning, comparing to how much sleep I got over the past previous two days, I was finally able to get a pretty decent night's sleep at the cottage last night. But anyways, we wrapped up our last day at Blue Mountain by saying bye to our cottage. All right, bye house. Blue Mountain 2023. What? Bye. 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 Then headed to the main Blue Mountain village to roam around a little bit, checking out their cool mini lift chair displays and getting the classic treat that the cousins always get while we're here called beaver tails. Also, on our way home, we stopped by our nearest on-the-go station to try our luck and buy some lucky scratch and win lottery tickets. Not a winner. Oh, I guess we don't win. <laughs> Dang it. And get a kid's meal toy that my cousins were able to enjoy and play with. Scooby, where are you, Scooby? Oh, right here. <laughs> the wife and I then went with the War Sisters to go to a local restaurant that we've been to before in the Jane and Shepherd area to get some very delicious Vietnamese food, as you guys can see here. Before we go home and rest and recover from this busy weekend. But anyways, before I wrap it up for the day, I have a quick birthday greeting to one of my former dance school friends that I had when I was younger. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Shelby. Happy birthday, Shelby. I'm hoping that you and your family at this time are doing well, staying safe and healthy, and that you had a great celebration for your birthday this year. 
But anyways guys, it's time to finally wrap up this week's busy and eventful episode. So if you guys have enjoyed what you've been watching, feel free to follow Walker POV on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. Be sure to like and share this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notifications bell to be notified when new videos from Jaywalker POV come out. And once again, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Stay safe and healthy out there, and we'll see you next time on Live From Last Week.